back and I'm about to face Misty, who saw me as a bitch. So we're going to see how far we're going to get. I may lose. In fact, I probably will lose. <laughs> My strategy here is to use Butterfree and Pikachu, which is the strategy I should have used, but I think he used... Only Butterfree, actually. I don't think he... No, he did use Pikachu, and Pikachu got KO'd, I think. Which is kind of stupid, but whatever. Stupoid. Stardew's just going to try and tackle its way to some kind of glory, I guess. No, 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 there's Water Gun. Dun, dun, dun. Probably should have got some potions. That would have been smart. I just realised I didn't. <laughs> Hopefully my team can take it out. This Starmie is going to be a problem. Send out Cheddar, maybe we can do some fair amount of damage. I think the Stormy knows recover as well. I think. I only wish Pikachu had learned Thunderbolt. Oh well. <laughs> Gotta do with what we've got. Oh crap, stop raising your defense. Pain in the ass. Well, I suppose on the bright side it's not attacking me. Well, now it is, but it wasn't. No! Pikachu, how could you almost be KO'd by that? Yeah, you use Harden, because now you're dead. Well, so much for me thinking that Starmie would be a problem. That bitch went down. <laughs> Misty just got pwned in the face. <laughs> yeah. You, you just got wiped out, man. That was embarrassing. <laughs> just get out, man. Yay, now I can use a TM HM I don't even have. Thank you. What does TM11 do? Bubble Beam? Yeah. Squirtle might be. That's actually quite useful because then I can teach it to Squirtle. Later. I think we can go and get Bulbasaur now before I forget. So let's go ditch a Pokemon. And I'm pretty sure you all know which one it is. Radita. He served me well in the last. Pokemon game I played, but this one he's not really stepping up to his game, so let's say goodbye to the Fanginator with his lame ass nickname. <laughs> and let's go get our Bulbasaur. Like I said, I don't know if Bulbasaur will stay with me till the end because I don't really like Bulbasaur and he's quite weak. Really? Isn't Bulbasaur meant to be the one protecting the injured Pokemon? Yay! I has Bulbasaur! Be right back for nickname! Um, I really couldn't think of a good nickname for Bulbasaur, so I just went with Dino. <laughs> As in Fred Flintstone and all that joyous fun. So Charmander is now level... Of course this thing's level 10, useless. Level 15, so we're going to work on leveling up Dino for a bit. I may do... Well, I will end up doing leveling up of those two off camera. But for now, we just trashed Misty and we're heading on out of here. Because now that stupid officer will let us past. About time. Hello, sir. I think he gives you dig or something. No, we go and we have to go and earn it apparently, and I already know who I'm going to teach it to. Hello, sir. Well, this is his own guy's fault for not se sealing off his yard because. There is a gap for us to walk through. I'll show you what I mean at the end. I don't know if you guys could see it, but he has an open yard. It's his own fault that Team Rocket were able to get in there in the first place. Um, Slasher. You can see that Team Rocket in this game is just going to have Ekans with Chop and all that fun stuff. But Chop looks like a rock type in this game. I don't know why, he just does. And he's an ugly colour. He's like not even close to grey. He's just like bath green for some reason. Drowl. Oh yeah, they also have Drowsy in this game. Drowsy is useless. Catch an Abra and then evolve it. And then it'll become more useful than a Drowsy ever would. Um, Sash is kind of low on health, as per usual. God, my Pokemon suck. I need some strong things. Like, I need a Charizard and I need one now. I'm pretty sure Vince won't stay till the end either. He might do. You never know. 
he might hang on in there till the end because I don't really know what else I'm going to catch other than Charmander, Bulbasaur and that lot. So yeah. Ah, oh, come on dude. Just got crit critical by a drowsy Vince. You should be ashamed. Level up. No you won't. I'm going to arrest you. Thank you. Now what we're supposed to see, this is what I mean, he has an open yard. Any old Joe could just walk in here, it's his own fault. Go, grow a bush now. And if you try and give it back to him, he'll just say that and he won't even, <laughs> it's like we're trying to give it back to him, but no, we're just going to steal it instead. We're not even going to try and give it back to him. And just keep his TM lost. And we're going to teach it to Slasher. Toothless can learn it as well. Hmm. Maybe I should have sold it to Toothless. Probably would have been more useful with Toothless actually now I think about it. Because Slasher might not even stay till the end to be honest. Because I'm going to have four Pokemon when I have that. So I'm going to have two slots to fill. Oh he might stay. You might, so uh, I'm just going to stick with it. It's too late now. I could have replayed it, but I'm not going to. I'll just stick to what I made, and if it screws me over, well, that's just life. I'm sure there's plenty of other moves we'll find along the road that Charizard can learn. Wow, what a boring path. Nothing is going on. It's just a place to walk. I think you just get given an item if you go in that house over there. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure on a lot of things. I just know where I'm meant to go and what I'm meant to do. No, that would be a shitty trade. I don't want to have one anyway. If you go down these hallways and press A repeatedly, you might find something. I don't know. You, later on in the game, get an item finder, which is kind of pointless. I've never actually found anything in these underground areas. Yes, they do, but I never find anything, even with stupid item finder. Stupid item finder is stupid. Ah, oh, crap. I've got this road. I'm just going to let you guys kiss and whatever you guys are doing. Screw you. I think he has, like, a butterfree or something. Oh, great. I have to fight you two, of course. Maybe I don't want to play with you. Go away, strange green-haired girl. At least it's not another lass. Though she has the same kind of poop on the last wood. Unfortunately. Uh cheddar, can wipe this thing out. Wipe it off the face of the planet, please. That is if you don't get KO'd first. <laughs> Thank you. And it's kind of like eh, he just leveled up again, whatever. Cause they're such low levels, they level up so easy. If only the whole game was like that. Dude. You just got wiped. What is it with you and your Pidgey, man? Your Pidgey army. Be gone. Jeez, why would you hoard Pidgey? It's the most crappy Pokemon before... Well, cra like Caterpie and Weedle are the crappiest Pokemon. Actually, Weedle's quite useful because he can still poison. Like... Caterpie can just use Tackle, but Weedle can at least poison the Pokemon, so he's slightly more useful than a Caterpie. Only slightly. Stupid Sparrow. I'm not going to risk using Cheddar again. He'll just get KO'd. Let's try Toothless. Why not? He's only a level below. He can give it a good try. Either way. Don't leer at me! I don't want my defenses to fall. Go leer at someone who cares. Haha, you missed. Toothless is too badass for you. Even though he looks like a hippo and not a lizard, but we'll get into that later. And when he evolves, he becomes a hippo with a horn. At least I think he does in this version. I think the sights are like... The slights? The sprites are slightly better in yellow than they are in red and blue. Emphasis on think. Whoa. Why is that thing's mouth so big and why is it off center? That always used to bother me as a kid. Like, Radicate's mouth is like bigger on one side than it is the other. 
And now it's going to ba bother all of you guys. Yay! Oh, crap. Thing's a beast. <laughs> and then it uses tail whip. And why is its foot bigger than the other? Did it, like, stand on a thorn and then it grew in size or something? Or is it an allergic reaction? Of course he hits. With this massive ass foot. I think it's meant to be stepped forward, but it kind of doesn't look like it. I seriously need to train. <laughs> yes, you better hurt yourself in confusion. How many of got beaten by Eradicate? That was sad. Go. Goodbye. Thank you. And Dino leveled up again and learnt Vine Whip. Sweet, it can actually do something now. I didn't start it. What are you, five? Oh my god, grow some balls, dude. And a quick trip to the Poke Center. May as well talk to some guys in here while I'm here. Just to see what the haps is in this town, I guess. Do, do, do. Thank you, your Pokemon are now fighting Pit. Oh, thank you. Stop bowing, I will not come back here again. <laughs> Sucks for you. No, really? Well, yeah, I kind of figured that one out. At least wild Pokemon evolve. Oh! Come on, that's just common sense. Dumbass. Stop sharing common uh, poker knowledge with me. Yes, I did. It was amazing. It was a ship. Because I'm on a boat, bitch. I think this guy just gave me a rod. This pervy old man gives me his old rod. Thank you. I will treasure it. I will catch many magic carp with it. Not. Seriously, the only Pokemon you can fish and catch. In this game, oh, Magic Carp, Goldeen occasionally, and a Tentacool, I think. That's pretty much all the pickings. Ooh, hello, Pikachu. Dude, that's called species interbreeding. No, it's not interbreeding. I can't remember what, it, the, what term for that is, but whatever, Pikachu, you just enjoy looking at that Clefairy, I guess. <laughs> So, dot dot dot, yes, because you give me an item when you finish having an orgy over your rapida rap rapidash, like, failing to talk much. Did you enjoy having your orgy in front of me? Thank you for the bike voucher, bitch. It was worth listening to you talk for like three hours, and Pikachu was still making eyes at this clefairy. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> How are we done, Pikachu? Just, you had your moments there. Let's get out of this place. It's corrupt. What are you doing, sir? You look like you're up to no good. You're gonna do some kind of dodgy business deal later on. That's right. This thing, this girl, I think we need to defeat Surge gives you a squirrel. This officer, she doesn't give you it yet. Unfortunately, I'm gonna buy some potions while I'm here. And they are super potions! Why would you need an ice heal at this point in the game? That's just stupid. Okay. Pokemon can be good or evil. No, all Pokemon are born evil. <laughs> um. Coming up to 15 minutes, so I'm going to call it a day. And this guy over here has been building this house for like 20 years now and he's got nowhere. So he should just give up on life. Anyway, so I'll see you guys in the next episode.